all right you guys so we're back again with another video here this video here you can see me lining the clip here all of the uh, ribbons have been pre-cut and pre-sealed so I'm just lining the clip here like so and as you can see this is a pretty quick process here And um, you can also see that I'm using two different types of ribbons here. And this bow is perfect for babies. Um, so Because I, I have a nine month old and I make these bows for her all the time. Okay, and then I'm just finishing up this um, this clip here. All right, and then after I finish lining the clip up, then um, I'm going to go ahead and cut the excess ribbon off of the alligator clip here like so and um, do just a safety seal just so that the ribbon won't fray. You'll see here in the video where I'm cutting with these dull scissors and didn't use my other ones. <laughs> now we'll try to pull it off and then you can see as it's trying to fray. So yeah, that, that's the reason why it's very important that you seal your ribbons. Okay, so once that is lined and ready to go, then you take your other ribbon, your longest ribbon, and then you just fold it into a circle. You just make a, a nice little perfect circle here. And then you put just a bead of glue on the bottom ribbon. Just a little small bead, not too much. And then you place the other side of the ribbon on top of that bead of ribbon, and that should form your perfect circle for you. And just hold that in place for just a few seconds. I would say about five seconds or so. Not too long. And see there, you have your, your perfect circle there. And then what you're going to do is take the top part of that circle. And you're just going to bend it down into the middle. And see where it makes like a little bow there. You just want to see how it looks. And then on the inside, on the bottom inside, you just put another bead of glue there. And then when you press down previously, just do that again and it'll hold that in place there. And see you have a bow, a little halfway bow there. And then you're going to take your alligator clip and then you're going to put like a bead of um, glue onto that clip. And you're just going to put your half made bow onto the alligator clip. Yeah, just place that in the middle there. I believe I made this bow a little bit too big. I should have had correct measurements. My apologies. <laughs> Again, I am learning. <laughs> All right, and just firmly press that on there for like two to three seconds. Shouldn't take that long for that glue there to um, to stick. Okay. I 
All right, and then your smallest part will be the middle part of your bow there to give it that finished look. So you're just gonna open the bow, I mean open the alligator clip, excuse me, and then you're gonna put a bead of glue onto the bottom. And then you're gonna put that ribbon, yes, on the bottom there in the middle. And then just close it up to give it extra security. And then you're gonna wrap it around the top of that bow there, just nice and firm. And then you're gonna take it back into between the alligator clip. And then just to kind of look at it, make sure it's where it's need to be. In this video here, mine was like kind of off, so I do apologize. I was moving a little bit too fast, but yeah, you're just gonna put a bead of glue up under that, and then you're just gonna go ahead and wrap that on around there like so. Then just press that down firmly, and then you're gonna cut off the excess ribbon that you have there. And then you're gonna seal the ends. What? Well, what? Well, that caught on fire. Whoo! Blow that out. <laughs> 911. <laughs> okay. And then once you have that, just foof up those um, sides of the bow there. And there you have it. You have yourself a mini clip. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. Like, subscribe, and share. Follow me on Facebook at Santavia Mitchell. Follow me on Instagram at Tinkle Toddlers. And if you'd like to place an order, please inbox me. Thank you.